Welcome back to more Atelier Ryza 2, everybody. So in between episodes, I actually did something really amazing. I was going to do it on, sc on screen, but then as I did, I was like, you know what? You've seen this before. I'm just using higher um, quality uh, higher quality materials for equipment. Basically, what I made is the Azertier, the Nimblehawk, and the Excelsior Brace, which are the three best ones, best weapons that you can make for these three respective characters at the moment. Uh, basically, it uses the Goldatarion, which you Goldatarion, which you can make with the Golden Knight, essentially. And yeah, just pick the highest quality materials for literally everything, and you should be able to get your weapons up to at least 500 quality. Uh, that one's 503. This one's 677. And I got really lucky with the with Ryza's because I just had the best fucking qualities and abilities to quality plus and stuff, and I got it up to 999. Believe it or not. Um, with this, and this is not over grinding at all, this is just literally gathering materials from the last place we were in, the last couple places we were in, which included the Magical Hidden Village and the Dragonbone Valley Edge. And yeah, do that and then just keep going to different places, make sure that your quality is at the highest for gathering, for using the staff, for everything, and you should easily be able to reach this. It's not that difficult, to be honest. Reinforce them with some pretty good equipment for some good uh, materials, I mean. And yeah, that's what I have. So this doesn't involve any more grinding because for levels, um, level 61, same as before, I didn't I didn't grind at any additional levels because I feel like I didn't need to do it. So um, yeah. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and gather some um, some stuff here, I believe. Wait a minute. Oh, here it is. Okay. I basically have to go around and gather all the different materials ever. Here's another one. Here's number two. Okay. Uh, the next one, I actually don't think I can go this way though. I believe it's closed off from this side. Yes it is. Yes it is. Oh my god, that thing actually almost got me. That would have been crazy. Oh wait, I can't go that way. What the fuck? Hold on. Hold on. I really have to take a look at this because... Okay, I see what I have to do. Oh my god. I'm gonna go around like this. Actually, I should look to see if any of these... Oh my god! Actually, you know what? This is a new enemy. Yeah, this is a new enemy. Let's fight this thing and let's just see how... how our weapons are now. We should be able to defeat this guy with relative ease because... You know? Our weapons are... Oh my god, look at that. That was only one damn skill. Let's do Blaze Rush. Damn. We are definitely up there in power. Gonna do that. And one more away and you'll basically be dead. Let's do some Shining Blast. Wait, didn't you die? What? Oh, no, okay, now you did. Now you did. How much experience? 2599? Okay. We're gonna hit that. Not that I really need this shit, but, um... It's fine. It's whatever. What is this? Um, I can actually use this. Okay. Kind of seeing to see if... Okay, there's also... Okay. Sorry, I'm looking to see that that, that thing doesn't actually get to me. Um, wait, where's the- oh, the chest is up there. Oh, so stupid. Okay. Here it is. Tiger Wolf Fangs, whatever that is. Okay, it looks like a weapon. Also, isn't there a thing here? Yeah, there is one right here. Oh my god, we need to run! Run! Damn, man. Okay, so we have to run kind of around like this, this way. And then into this pathway here. Oh, look at this. Okay, so that's another one. Uh, we have to keep going over to the left side, avoid these damn enemies, of course. Jesus, Jesus, that was close. Oh my god, man. Okay, and then here... Yeah, there's gonna be two right there. It's pretty simple because I believe I just have to go run down to the bottom and then around. Okay, there's one actually. Oh god. That thing is totally after me. Okay, and then I'm gonna- oh god, okay, okay, I need to run. Oh, Jesus. Of 
Grab it and go. Seriously, just grab it and go. Shit. Okay, so we got those two. Now we have to go to the left. Actually, how do I keep... No, I think this is directly up that way because I got a two there already, so... I believe I'm right. Okay, I need... Actually, no, I can fit. So it's straight up through here. Like this, up these steps, and that's actually going to be a boss, I believe, right up there. But we should be able to tackle this thing pretty easily. Boss battle time, it's basically a copy-paste from the previous boss, just a different color scheme. Yeah, but it's pretty much the same damn thing, uh, so... Yeah, this will by far be the most difficult battle, uh... Um, you know, to this date with this Let's Play, but, um... It shouldn't be too difficult because we did just get a bunch of, um, you know, nice weapon upgrades and better stats, so I think I'll be fine, hopefully. Just gotta be aggressive here, pay attention to the, uh, to when his attacks go up there so we can actually go ahead and guard it. Here it comes. Oh, actually, okay. Hold on, let's see. Oh, god damn it. Well, the timing was a little off with that, but whatever. I guess we're getting your HP down there a bit. Alright. Good amount. As you can see, we're definitely doing some good damage. One, two, three. Let's try the Okay, so you actually resist that one. It's important to know that. Shit. That was a pretty good amount of damage. Okay, so we can do that much, that much, and then Shining Blast is... Well, that's technically fine. Let's do Whirlwind. I'm trying to see what you're actually weak to, but... What about... Hmm, neither are these two. That was not a perfect guard. It's a little difficult to get this timing. Shining Blast, Shining Blast Plus. Okay. That was a pretty good amount of damage there. 32, 154, cool, that's a double right there. And then, ooh, nice. Good damage, good damage. Okay, we're about to be up there in our tactics level. That's good. Okay, so you are actually weak to Shining Blast Plus Plus, apparently. Oh my god. We're actually both broken, as you can see. That's a little crazy. I should actually do Item Rush here, because I don't want to fucking die. Dry Biscuit on you. That would actually make the most sense. There we go. I guarded that, but... My god. Okay, we're gonna do that and that. Yeah, so it is Shining Blast that is gonna be the, the way here. Okay, there we go. Tactics level 5. Now we're in a really good position here. To be able to do a lot of damage. We also have Fatal Drive going. Here we go. One, two, three, four. 
I guess I can do a blaze rush too if I really wanted to do that. Break. Good damage, good damage. That's 261 additional. And then this one's going to do another 431. Wow. Alright, here we go. I'm just going to spam all this, of course. Damn it. Oh, that's fine. I couldn't, I couldn't get that guard there. Oh yeah, no, we're, we're good. We are good here. Damn it. What was that? Okay, I don't know what that was. <laughs> Four and five. And just spam all this shining blast. It's close to dead. Why is that timing so freaking awkward? <laughs> Okay, Shining Blast should be able to take care of a very significant amount here. Oh, hell yeah. He's like two turns away. Maybe one turn away. We'll see. Well, we're going to get some more good moves off here. Icy Fascination, followed by... Oh, hell yeah. Look at that. I could I could technically do Fatal Drop. Oh, no. You're, no, that's it. You're charging, so you're totally dead. You can't survive this. There's no way. You're only a quarter filled up, so nope. That's it. That wasn't too bad. That was definitely not too bad. Hopefully we got a good amount of level ups from this. That'd be pretty amazing if we do. Uh, oh, hell yeah. We got two level ups from that. Nice. これでピーを元気にしてあげられるね。いつまたピーが倒れるかわからない。早く水晶のところへ行きましょう。うん。ピー、もうちょっとだからね。Okay, now inspecting the crystal thing will actually oh no, I think it's going to be automatic. But actually, I'm not sure. Let, let me... Fuck, dude. No, dude, you can't just... Are you, are you serious? I need you to fly away. Are you... Dude, get out. Move. So there are two things on... There's like one on each side. Okay, this is so stupid. This stupid enemy. Oh my god, this is so annoying. Oh... Gotta be kidding me, man. Giant Mo, I think I've killed these before. Let me just... Oh, Jesus. I hate it when they put stupid mandatory like enemies like that. There's nothing you can do. That kind of stuff really pisses me off in RPGs. Like, you know, if you're gonna do a mandatory battle, do some freaking... scripted battles. Like an actual cutscene that leads to that scripted battle, you know? Not some freaking... It's a random encounter, but at the same time, not really, because it's fucking mandatory. Like, you gotta be kidding me, man. That's so dumb. Okay. Luckily, I sure would've killed this guy really fast. Okay, please kill him. Please kill him for me. Right now. Or I'll just do it myself. There we go. Alright, yeah, we got rid of the annoying enemy. Okay, so there are in fact two. Now, I don't think I can actually do this all in one trip, though, because uh, the main reason why is because I think we're going to get automatically warped out. Wait a minute. Oh, yeah, I can go through here. Okay, I was like, what the hell? We have to go here because there's actually one on each side. One of these fragments on each side. Oh, God, oh, God. Something was... I couldn't see... The thing, uh, I was looking at- oh my god. Really? Wait, there's only one? God, these things are so ruthless. They actually see you from so far. I'm just like, what in the world is going on, man? Okay, Blaze Rush. Maybe that'll do a little bit more. I'm still tactics level 2, are you shitting me? Well, actually, no, I was already- well, what am I talking about, but... Okay, please. Please, please, please. Kill him this turn. Only this turn. 
Shining Blast and Shining Blast Plus. Okay, cool. Oh my god, okay, be very careful about how you maneuver here because these enemies apparently can snipe you from afar. This is crazy. I freaking hate those. Yeah, they also move so fast. Oh, I could just go across? No, I can't. I need the better freaking thing that I haven't crafted yet. Damn it. Hmm. That's unfortunate. That would have been a really nice shortcut, you know? But yeah, we actually can. So we have to go like this. Crawl through here. And now we have to make our way all the way to the left side. Okay. Also, what is this? Oh, okay. Um, we'll go like this, I suppose. Oh, shit. Go, 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 go. Oh my god, is that a mandatory freaking battle? This is not good, this is not good. They're all gonna see me, they're gonna... Shit. Shit, dude. Run, 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 this is crazy. Oh my god, oh my god. There's so much shit in here, okay. Dude, there's no freaking way. There's... Oh. No. Oh. Run. No, 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 no. Okay, I can't believe I made it through there. The problem is the thing is going to actually see me, I'm pretty sure. Oh my god, I can't believe I escaped that. Okay, now we're going to come up here. I think the cutscene's going to actually take us back automatically. さんにオンペルさんどうしたんですかそんな結層会でライザーダメだそいつに触れたらえオンペルさんやったフィやっと元気になったみたいだよかったやっぱりフィはこうでなくちゃこれで全ての鍵が開いてしまったなんてことだ恐れていた最悪の事態になってしまうとはどういうこと二人ともそんな顔して順を追って説明したいがここで長話をするわけにもいかん一度町へ戻ろうそこで私たちの知った真実を話す私の調査が正しければこの王都のほど近くにある遺跡壁画が描かれていたあの大遺跡の奥に異界への門があるえマジかよあの遺跡の扉は他の五つの遺跡にある鍵によって閉じられている壁画の内容はそういうことだでも鍵って他の遺跡にはどこにもそんなものなんてそれぞれの遺跡の奥に水晶があっただろうあれが鍵だ正しくはあの水晶が持っていた魔力が鍵だったと言った方が良いかあれはまさしく異界にある魔石で作られていたもっともあそこまで巨大なものは滅多に見か
あの水晶に魔力が宿っている間は大遺跡の扉には鍵がかかっているしかし何らかの方法で魔力の供給を閉ざした時あるいは魔力そのものが失われた時鍵が開くどどうなるってんだよ I know he can go at the bus to the I saw when you give up to be like a I did a kind of say that the guy So go Then show no go who no sucking it to read the art it's so you eat me that the look up He's a kid no cause is a knock up thunder So No Not the other she was P が元気になるようにって元気になって嬉しいなって思ってそれであれらの遺跡を作った当時の連中もまさかこの生物がこちらの世界にいるというのは想定外だったんだろう異界の魔力がなければ長くは生きていけないからなだが扉が開いたこと自体は別に大した問題ではない問題なのは大物のフィルスサが目覚めている可能性があるということだそんなやつがいるのかよそそれってあの虫歯みの女王みたいなやつ3年前になんとか倒したあのそれを上回る可能性すらあるとはいえ伝説でしかない確証は何もないが私もその話は知っているわでも私は役目が違うからそこまで詳しくはないけれど二人とも知っているとなるとそういうやつがいるってのもただのヨタ話じゃなさそうだな無論必ずそいつがやってくるという話ではないただ何かが目覚めている可能性はあるどうしてそんなことがわかるんですか虹の卵は王の目覚め連なる虚勢のたもとより緑を焦がす災い来たる今のってずっとわからなかった伝承の箇所だアンペラさんどこでそれを湖の底の遺跡にいた星の民からだおかげで伝承について知ることができた私たちが独自に調べた情報を持っていったところ失われていた記憶がよみがえってきたらしいなるほどなつまりその災いっていうのがリラさんたちの言う大物のフィルフサってことか伝承の他の部分もその内容はどれも真実のようだったならば災いというのも何かの真実について書かれていると考えるのが自然だ虹の卵は王の目覚めっていうのは王の目覚めってこの部分がフィルフサの大物が目覚めているかもって言った理由かあと私ちょっと思い出したことがあるんですライザさん最初に持ってましたよね虹色っぽく光っていた石をんそれってフィーの卵のこともしかしてフィーが卵から帰ったことって何かに関係しているんじゃないでしょうかフィルフサの王が目覚める何かのきっかけになったのではということねフィーということはまたフィルフサがこっちにやってくる可能性がないとはとても言えないなんとかしなきゃまずは本当に扉が開いているのか確認しないと。
Alright, so that was quite the cutscene. Uh, what I'm gonna do now... I'm actually not sure how many... Oh, okay. Underworld Gate again. We just have this one with Tal. We can easily do that, but before I do that... I actually want to go back into... What the hell am I doing? Back over here. Because, unfortunately, that cutscene automatically does um, remove us from getting those last fragments. So we have to... Um, we gotta get that stuff. Luckily, it's not far at all. We just have to kind of like maneuver around here, you know, a little carefully. I think here the only way is going to be to go this way, and then I have to run around. Um, it shouldn't be too bad, because it's the easier part of the map that doesn't have a clusterfuck of enemies everywhere, you know? Okay, this one I'm going to have to actually kind of guide him over, and then run around. There we go. And then we'll just keep going. Let's see. So... There's going to be two fragments to get here. Um, that's a little awkward. Actually, that's very awkward. What the fuck kind of enemy placement is that? Wait, where am I? Um, okay, I just have to... What about this way? That might actually be easier once I guide this guy over. A little more? Oh my god, that was close. Okay. that and then like this and then finally proceeding straight ahead all right there's gonna be two here one blue and one yellow I'm pretty sure yeah I see them up there okay let's just go through all the way and I also saw some new items over here I think yes I did white moon frost and ancient blue water okay I mean I'll take this stuff hell yeah I will uh, what else is is there anything else that's new here It all seems the same. Okay. We'll take this. And then we will take... How do I... Oh, I just go from here. Perfect! Alright, so now we got all of them. Wait, let me make sure. We did get them all, right? We are at 9 out of 9. Yes, we did. Going back to the atelier, I suppose. And we got some stuff to do with that. Uh, we're gonna say... Okay, all that. Okay. We are going to... Hold minus. And which one is it? This one. Okay, so we'll start with... We'll start with either of these, I suppose that's fine. So we just have this one. Recipe for medicine and strange symbols. Okay, hopefully this doesn't take too long. Alright, this one's complete. Nice. Okay, another 800 SP. Now we're gonna go over to this one. This one is actually missing three. Wow, mage manipulating stars? Okay. Can we have offering two heads? Uh, bone Staff and Dragon Head. Did I see that somewhere? Okay, like that, and that one's done. Alright, and the fifth one. Ooh, another 1200, nice. The fifth one is going to be this one. We can open it now. Well, I mean, we just got it, but you know what I mean. Okay. Mana Vessel and Reason for Prosperity. Oh, I saw the word Vessel there. I thought it was that one. Uh, that's Vessel, okay. Uh, next one is Flow of Mana and Two Dragon Heads. Flow of... Maybe, no. I saw, oh my god, I saw Flow of Mana there. Wow. Demon Stones and Mana... Oh, Mana Flowing again. I just saw Mana Flowing. Okay. We have three more. We have Losing Fragment and Immortality Gone. Whoops. Okay. Then we have Power of Frozen Moon. Oh, what the hell? A trick me. They both have frozen moon. <laughs> okay, and that's it. How much do we get from this? We get another 1500. Wow. Alright, that one's done. Research is complete. Perfect. And now all we have left is going to be this one. That's, uh, oh no, which one? This one, which is only at 7%. Well, that's going to be because it's also the final thing. Um, we are going to now go into the skill tree and use up 8200. Oh my god. Okay, um, basically everything left here is, well, oh yeah, I have these Evolution Link and Light Mist. Sure. I'll grab Evolution Link and Light Mist, whatever this is going to be, but we'll do it. Sure. How many, any tutorials? Yes, actually. 
もっと新しいことができる気がしてきたぞ一つを二つにするんじゃなくて逆に二つを一つにするような考えてても仕方ないか何事もまずは挑戦してみようエボリューションリンク using a reinforceable triple cauldron will unlock the evolution link option Evolution Link lets you combine accessories and items with other objects, activating special new EV effects. EV effects are powerful effects that can do multiple things. Try different combinations to get more powerful items. There are even some items that can only be created through secret combinations. Rise the skill level now allows her to obtain Light Mist. Light Mist is a more powerful version of the Elemental Mist. The essences that can be refined with the light mist can only be used once during synthesis but have very powerful effects. However, it can only be obtained very rarely compared to the other types of mist, so you have to choose carefully when to use it. Okay, so that was the two additional tutorials there, because I did unlock those two, but now we have other stuff. These rebuild things, I'm gonna actually try to. Oh shit, but there's stuff back there, huh? Okay, well, it makes sense to go for this now, finally, core drive. So with Core Drive Unlocked, this does actually break pretty much all the others, I believe. Or no? Wait, I already unlocked it. Oh, I think I have to actually witness the tutorial. My bad. Core Drive. Core Drive is a core item special attack and can be used once its conditions are met. Each character can equip one Core Drive from the Modify Core Crystal menu. If all the conditions are satisfied, select an item to unleash its Core Drive. All Core Drives are powerful, but each character can only use one per battle. So be sure you wait until the perfect situation to use it. Alright, so with that, now we can use the skill tree to unlock all these different core drives. Aurora Wave, Uni Hurricane, Dark Explosion, Hollow Targeting, Eradicating Poison, Eternal Loop, Angelic Embrace, Gravity Press, Testament Meteor, and cool. Alright, I am back, so sorry about that, I had to take care of something really quick. Uh, let me actually zoom out here so I can... I'm gonna buy some of these, but the thing is, how do you actually know which one of these, like, belongs to a particular character? Is there is there any way to know? I don't think so. Okay, so that's that one. This one's 900. I guess I'll buy this hollow targeting one, whatever that shit is, sure. Um, I think, and, or can any of these be used by any damn character? Like, I'm over here thinking, like, is this, like, quickenings, like, in Final Fantasy XII, you know? Or not? I don't freaking know. I actually don't know. Okay, so we got that one. Um, are there any more on the right side? There actually may not be. So there's a 15, and there's a 12, and there's a 9, and there's a 6, and there's a 12. Okay, so I'm gonna do this one plus this one. Oh, but I only have 700 now, so I can't get the 900 one. Shoot! Oh, that's okay. Yeah, so now I have one 900, a 1200, a 15, and a 12. And then I have these two that are rebuild plus whatever the hell, but okay. Sounds good. Um, so that takes care of that. Uh, the only other thing I can think of doing is just triggering these events, like the one with tail. So let's see what we can actually do here. If we get an event. Because obviously the story progression, but that's probably going to be for the next episode. Since we're kind of up there in time, but... Yeah, so I'm gonna go over to the right side now and witness this event. Let's see. Tao, daijoubu? Hmm, heiki sa. Juubun ni atama mo hie ta shi ne. Okage de, jibun no kimochi mo suiri dekita yo. Boku ga nani o kangaite ita no kamo wakatta shi ne. 
遺跡のことばかりだと思ってましたけど<笑>間違ってはいないよ事実僕は自分の興味や知識を全部使ってなりたかったんだ何になりたかったの何にって聞かれると返答に困るなすごく漠然としたものだからつまり僕はさご先祖様に並ぶようなすごい人になりたかったんだよご先祖の方に対抗心を抱いていたということですかうんまあそういうことになるかなでもそれにこだわりすぎて本来の目的を忘れちゃってたんだから世話がないよねっていうかどうして自分のルーツとかご先祖様に並びたいとか思ったの私3年前のタオはそんなこと考えてなかったように見えたけど島にいた頃は思いもしなかったよ辺境の島育ちの僕なんかとは違う王都の人たちを見るまではねすみませんタオさんの言ってる意味が私にはつまりねコンプレックスを感じたんだよ王都で暮らす人たちと自分の姿を比べてねちょちょっと待ってタオでもそんなこと考えるの<笑>こっちに来てからそれなりにねかっこ悪いし恥ずかしい話なんだけどそういうのタオさんは気にしない人だと思ってたから。正直意外でしたけどタオさんは自分で思っているほど何でもない人ではないと思いますそうだよ大昔の遺跡を調査して解読できる人なんて会ったことないし貴族である私の家庭教師を任されているというのも忘れないでほしいですボースの言った通りねタオは夢中になると周りが見えなくなる自分がどれほどすごいのかっていうのも含めてね同感です少なくともタオさんのご先祖様はそんなことを考えてはいなかったと思いますただまっすぐに好きなことを一生懸命やってただけなんじゃないですかそうかパティの言う通りだよ好きなことを思いっきりやってたからご先祖様はあんなにすごい人になれたんだなのに僕はただすごい人になりたくてありがとうパティ僕なんか目の前が明るくなった気がするよええはいそれはよかったんでしょうか<笑>多分ねよーし気持ちを切り替えてもう一度集めた資料を読み直そうどこへ向かうつもり All right, that's actually a good time to end this video. Um, I do want to see if we are going to unlock anything else. I believe we are because we're not done with Tails cutscenes actually. So let's see if we unlock anything else by sleep in two days. We're typically just making any one thing. Will be enough. Oh, we'll see. We'll see. L like, for example, if you go here to synthesize, if you make any one damn thing, like just whatever, you know, like let's make a really shitty item for whatever reason. Let's do that. Typically, by doing this, plus we get SP. You will. Oh, well, see. Maybe we're not actually. Hmm, I don't know. That's kind of weird. One thing I haven't actually shown you is if, if I'm able to, like. Oh look, I actually can. I can make certain stuff. Like, remember how I was trying to, um, um, morph a lot more? Looks like I might be able to do it. Like, where's the... what's up there? Seems like I can. Like, if I do that, plus another one of these. And then morph into that. Yep. Morph time. It's morphin time. <laughs> There we go. We morph, and now we get a new one. Spirit Bottle. Nice. Uh, nothing is actually unlocking, though. 
So I guess we're done with all these scenes. That means next time we can freely go ahead and um, proceed into... Yeah, wow, that's crazy. Oh, wait. Oh, it did show up. Why didn't it tell me? Okay, so I'm going to have to warp into the atelier, basically, I believe. I think so. We'll see what happens. So before I end this video, I would like to encourage you to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and turn on notifications if you enjoyed the video. I post multiple gaming videos on a daily basis, so hopefully you enjoy my channel. Bye-bye, everyone. Have a great and, of course, a fantastic day.